Well, the Kinetic Art Drawing Machine is really an object lesson in how to create interesting uh, graphics from very, very minimal uh, component parts. And we have an electric motor, a battery, a pen of some kind, easy bend wire, which makes the frame up, and um, a couple of cable clips. And that's all required. So if I put those to one side, to get movement, we need to um, put a rubber tip on the end of the motor which creates friction when it's in contact with paper and that if we let it rest on a piece of paper at the right angle will produce um, movement. In fact it will produce quite rapid drive movement. So if we can angle the motor on the paper at the right um, number of degrees we should be able to get um, rotary movement and all we need to do really is to prop the pen against the motor in some way and prop the battery box against those two objects in order to have uh, three points of contact on the paper and that with the motor driving will give us some kind of um, movement <coughs> The easy bend wire is the material that bends to a nice tight radius by default and we can bend that very quickly into practically any form that we require to hold those three items and that therefore is an ideal prototyping material for rapid results, not necessarily the permanent result but for prototyping. So if I put those to one side and bring in one that was produced earlier. The easy bend wire was folded at fairly arbitrary angles to contain the battery box, the pen and the motor. And you'll notice that in order to um, secure the motor and the pen, both of which are circular in section, um, the easy bend wire has been folded once so it sits flat on the cylinder of the pen and the motor. And although the angles are quite arbitrary, you get three point contact with the paper, pen tip, battery and motor tip, and the motor just has to be at a very very slight angle in order for it to drive. So if I now set this running, it should go round in more or less concentric circles the lid off and the movement can be adjusted and programmed simply by changing the angles of the pen with respect to the motor with respect to the battery box now that will repeat and eventually produce a very interesting spirograph type pattern and if I want to start it somewhere else I can overlay patterns with different colors and if I want it to do something um, completely different I could for instance attach a spring to the pen with a little mass um, wobble the spring and then it will shake around and change direction as it, um, as it moves in a circular path. <coughs> 